Hi guys, um, today I want to kind of talk about one word uh, in particular. I've noticed it on my profile um, and on other people's uh, feed as well. It is the word pigmented. I'm trying to fit it within those 90 seconds that I have or else a part two will follow. But what about the word pigmented? Um, I noticed it's been used a couple of times when a very chromatic paint was made uh, with a very chromatic pigment that gave off a lot of color and people said, wow, this paint is so pigmented. That just does, does not make sense to me. It's like saying, wow, this water is so wet. Um, it's a pigment property. And uh, when you compare student quality paint versus artist quality paint, the pigment load in artist quality paint is more dense than the one in student quality paint. So one would be more pigmented than the other. Uh, same goes for color pencils, crayons, things like that. But when we're talking about uh, handmade watercolors, where um, uh, my proportions are always kind of the same. I'm, I'm putting the maximum load of pigment into my paint. Um, I, I can't say that one paint is more pigmented than the other, but they're all as pigmented as they can be. But the tinting strength, that's the thing that most people, I think, are talking about, or how chromatic a pigment is. Uh, follow for part two.